All right, let's go. I'm just hiding this until... Uh... That's illegal graffiti. What is it, a cafeteria? It's the worst, it's the worst, um... Hi, this too? Here? Yeah, anyway. right. I'm live streaming. Right. Thank you. Nobody cares when I say that. But yeah. I, I, it's like I have to say it though. Yeah, what yeah. is this? Korean news? Wow. Yeah. I feel immersed now. Should we sit on the same side again or no? Uh yeah, so we can both get in the tape in, in the thing here. So we can have a combo. Yeah, and so we can uh, touch dicks. Okay. Well, now I know you're not joking when you say that to me. Well, I, I, like I said, I prefer girls just because girls look better, but dudes do suck a way better dick. That's just one experience, though. Or two. Have you... I think this works a lot. Have, have, okay. you, have you never... Uh, you've never been with a dude like that, have you? No. You're missing out. Really? You're missing out. I'll pass. I mean, why... Why? Just why? You, you always got to experience something new every time, every day. You don't have to. I mean, this, this is a thing, like, if you can't, if you have no sexual desire towards uh, the, op the same sex, like, you can't force it. Well, I mean, true that. I mean, I was drunk. I, I don't have any desire. I, I'm not, what, into, I'm not into dudes. Did you pick him up or he picked you up? Um... He came up to me, uh, and I was just like, okay, I'm willing to try this out. Are you trolling me? Do I seem like the type of guy to troll? Yeah. How can you tell? Um, nothing you did right now, but in the car, when I first called you out, you had like a little silly smirk, and that kind of gave you I just smoked a little bit of weed before I got here. Nothing crazy. I mean, I don't know what you're talking about. No, I mean, I'm, I'm not a trolley guy, but I do like to fuck around. But this is a real story. And chat will tell you. I've said it many a times. Stories never changed. What is this? That's kimchi. It's spicy. Ah, oh, no. This one's not that spicy. What is this? An, uh, an onion? Like chopped onion or something? Um... Okay. Yeah, I think so. It's cabbage. Eh, okay. No, this, this you're gonna like. It's not bad. It's a chicken dumpling soup. It's really tasty. It's not spicy, you said, right? Not at all. Right, because the spicy, uh, I don't like the spicy, man. It makes my butt all hurt later. Nah, it's zero spicy. Mm. It's very comforty. It's good for Uncle Andy and his hangover. Oh. He needs something like this, you know? You don't go to McDonald's or Burger King or something? Not a McDonald's type of motherfucker. Or like some fried food or something? Like some some fried fish or something? Mm, nah. Hi, how you doing? Hi, how you doing? I'm gonna order for you, okay? Is that cool? I mean, as long as you have good taste. Yeah, you gotta get it. It's the specialty. We're gonna get some stuff to share, too. Can we please have um, two orders of the dumpling soup? Um, and uh, beef bulgogi. Um... Hi. Hi. We're live streaming, is that cool? <laughs> it's tw Twitch. It's live streaming. You guys, is that okay? Um, Come on, you want to be on, on video? Come on. Come yeah, on, you, you little cuties. <laughs> um, and we'll get also uh, the bim bim bop. The what? Bim bim bop. Bim bim bop. Mm, bop, 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 bop. Sounds like bop. a. Some kind of K-pop song. Iced tea. What? Iced tea. No, we have a hot tea. Hot tea. Yeah. Hot tea. Yeah. Uh, we have a bottle of water. Bali tea. No. What do you? Ice water and hot bali tea. That's do you guys have coffee? No, no coffee. No, just tea and hot tea and ice water. Is that all you have? Yes. Uh, okay, yeah, I'll take so a, I'll take a hot tea. Okay. Is How many hot tea? One? With a lemon. Ah. Uh, lemon? <laughs> no lemon. <laughs> do you have lemons? For him. Yeah. <laughs> we have a check, we have a I'll just, okay, I'll get a hot tea. Okay, hot tea. All right, you're a hot tea. <laughs> get it? <laughs> All right, I'll have a hot tea. Menu. Okay, two hot tea for you. Yeah. Two. yeah. Thanks. Yeah. All right. <laughs>
I guess they don't have lemons here or something. I don't know. That's interesting. Yeah. I go to a lot of weird spots. Like, there's one spot that, um, it's like a 24-hour uh, place that just sells, like, goat soup. Goat soup? Yeah. Like, they put the goat meat in the soup? Yeah. It's really good. He's Andy. No! <laughs> Mission? <laughs> Hello? Dude, how did you find it? Yeah. How did I leak it? Hello? <laughs> how did we leak it? I, like I said, I think they called every restaurant within like a 10 mile radius of Koreatown. Oh my God. I tell you, they do that junk, dude. Bro, I'm scared about starting my stream up now because like I'm just, I'm starting to get into the IRL stees and I'm just like. Here, let's just, let's take the phone. And what I, what I always do is I, I sit on the phone. Well, they're probably gonna want it back. Oh, well, I mean, I'm not, I'm, oh, yeah, you you want, oh, you want the phone back? Yeah. Okay. I usually just like take the phone, I like hide it somewhere and then like we don't have to deal with it anymore. Huh? Yeah. yeah, we got two dumpling soups, one bulgogi and one bimbibap. No phone call. We didn't tell them to call. So yeah, we, we, um... I think it was a fluke. We don't, we don't know who they are. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> We, we don't tell well, Basically, we're live watch. streaming. Yeah. And, they, you know, they're watching the live stream, so... Mm -hmm. I don't know if that's going to be okay or not. Yeah, we, we're going to uh, tell them no more calls. Okay. We told them not to call, but they found your number. Thank you. Okay, thanks. Ruins. You guys got to ruin shit. Andy, you know what? What? You never tell them not to do something. You never tell them not to do something. But we didn't even tell them the place, dude. How'd they find it out? They called every Korean place, <laughs> dude. Every single one, guaranteed. Right. I, I really hope they don't kick us out here. I know, this place is good. <clears throat> Yo, but for real, guys, I mean, my, I don't understand. I know there's a lot of people, so some people might not really give a fuck, but like, you'd think if people are fans of you and what you do, they wouldn't try to ruin your time. Where there's fans, there's a lot of haters, man. And not only, I mean, they're not haters, they're just... Uh, I feel like a lot of the kids who call are not even haters. They're just like... They're not. They're just like... They think it's they funny. They love you and they think it's funny. And they're just like, oh, oh, you're mad? Ha, ha it's funny that you're mad. It's like, that's one experience I had. I used to get beat with sticks on the playground when I was in kindergarten. They were my friends, but it was funny. They thought it was funny to beat me with sticks. And I didn't, I, I didn't like that, okay. but <laughs> I didn't like that, but uh, you know they beat me anyways because it was uh, you know it was all fun and games. <laughs> Same thing applies with the phone. Sticks and stones may break your bones. Well, they never said word words to me, but the the sticks the, the, actually sticks don't break your bones. No. But they leave a killer bruise. Stones do though. Yeah, yeah, you don't ever want to get a stone thrown at you. That's like uh, the death penalty or some shit. Yeah, don't tell that, um, don't tell that ladyboy story in Jamaica. You might get stoned. Why? They're very, very homophobic. In Jamaica? Yeah. Aren't they, I thought they smoke a lot of weed. Aren't they supposed to be like chiller, like chill? Like, oh yeah, my brother, yeah, they're dicking your ass. No. No? No, they're very homophobic. They like throw they throw rocks at gays. It's really disgusting. That's the one I'm thing I don't real. like about dancehall reggae. Because dance like reggae is my favorite type of music, but like some of the like dancehall artists are just like mega mega homophobes. Unfucking believable. I say Amer I say America go to Jamaica, and we clean them up. Like we tidy them up a little bit. You know, get the get the get that bullshit out of here. Give get them that some homophobia out there. Get, get some liberal laws over in Jamaica. This is bullshit. Yeah, you voted for Trump, right? <laughs> Only, well, I, I I voted for Trump because <laughs> Hillary was on the other side. Not because Trump's the best president in the what world. What do you think Hillary's main downfall is? Well, um, I feel like if she were to go on her period, she'd hit that nuke button and the end of the <laughs> world would be had. 
and she lies. Her emails were, ex were need to be exposed. True. Um, and Bill Clinton cheated on her, but she didn't care. That's not the sign of a leader. It's the sign of a fucking loser. Exactly. So at least Donald Trump, he's the one doing the cheating on the women. Yeah. So it's like, okay, more of a leader. Grabbing by the pussy. Exactly. You know Donald Trump couldn't even have a Twitch account. He'd be banned. Why do you say so? Because he'd be grabbing girls by the pussy, and then they would be, he'd be banned. So like, you, Donald Trump is not even good enough to be on Twitch when actually, they're getting banned, and he's our president. I looked at uh, a, a list of companies that actually support Trump. Amazon is one of those companies. So I don't think they would ban him because Amazon supports Trump, and Amazon runs Twitch. So I, I, I think Amazon would like be like, no, we need him on our platform. There's a lot of viewers to be had right there. If he did speeches from his like house in, mm -hmm. in Mar-a-Lago or something. All oh, the phones ringing. They hate us right now. Yeah, let's just not even mention it. Yeah. They'll stop. Uh, what is that? Is that South Korean news or North Korean? Probably South, right? I don't think the radio waves reach North Korea. I think they like block it out or something, right? Mm. I have no idea. That's what I heard at least. I was watching a lot of documentaries a couple days ago. Have you watched Planet Earth yet? No. What's that? Bro, let me tell you something. You get a little marijuana, you sit down, nice TV, and they have these high def like crazy hour episodes of like nature and animals and like crazy. That sounds boring as fuck. Bro, you're fucking bugging, bro. It is so entertaining. About you nature? See, like, dude, but you see like crazy shit happening, man. Like, like you see these like you see these lizards hatch and like right when they hatch they have to make a crazy long run to the ocean and just like right when they're born all these crazy snakes come after them and start attacking them. It's like really action packed. You're a sick person, Andy. And it's like, uh, it's just shot, it's shot so well. It, take, it takes like six years for them to make. You know, that's not interesting to you? No, you're sick. That's murder, that's animal abuse, and they're televising see, that. Earth pod champs, they're, they're, see. they're televising the murder of animals, and that's despicable, not right, it's stupid. I mean, when I when I if I when I used to smoke a lot of weed in high school, I just walked just like uh, South Park, and I, I did like uh, I watched YouTube, like uh, you know, I did like a lot of you know those tests on YouTube you can take to see if you're like smart or something like a math test or something or yeah, yeah. sociopath test. Yeah, I did a lot of that when I was high as fuck. And what did you score? Uh, well, I'm a sociopath who has schizophrenia, psychotic, and I'm stupid. Really? Mm-hmm. But do you really have schizophrenia, though? Oh, well, I mean, that's what YouTube told me, but I mean, I don't think so. The only <laughs> the only voice in my head is my own, so, you know. <laughs> and my own. <laughs> I mean, you have a voice in your head, right? Like, you're one, the one voice? It sounds like your, your well, own you voice? Well, you know, a lot of people ask me where I get my ideas from, my comedy and stuff. I don't have one voice in my head. I have like a choir of babies singing and it kind of like the data from that gets like filtered and then it like goes into like a different chamber of my brain where it comes out like just one voice with ideas. That is not only schizophrenia, <laughs> that is uh, so you're thinking about babies and I mean and, 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 and a very uh, all the time. No, it's like it's me though, it's me. You're a sick person. Yeah, I am. I'm just joking. That's actually tight, but uh, have, you, have you ever taken those tests online? You know what I'm talking about? I've taken an AIDS test online, but I didn't know where to put my blood. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, real though, have you ever had an HIV test? Because they have free HIV tests around here. I took one. I'm so, I'm too scared. If what? I if, if I get AIDS, I'm going to just die of AIDS. Well, you might as well know if you have AIDS or not, no, right? No, I'm too scared. I'm too scared, dude. Well, I mean, you're gonna find out eventually if you have AIDS, yeah, if you're starting to disintegrate and die. Yeah, I'm friends with Martin Shkreli though, so he's got me. You're gonna throw me some AIDS medicine. For a lot of money. Nah, man, I got the hookup. Oh, uh -oh. here's our dumpling soup. Martin, Martin Scammy. Martin Scammy. I'm just joking, I don't have AIDS, so who cares? I mean, not, Thank you. not really, but. All right, so this is dumpling soup. 
What's this brown stuff? Uh, it's like, like meat. Oh, I thought it was not like oatmeal or something. We got some chicken dumpling soup. I promised you it's not spicy. And I lived up to my promise. All right, let me try this out. It'll be pretty hot. That's fine. Right away. That's fine. You're gonna blow on it? Uh, I'm gonna see what I can do. I'm gonna be I'm gonna be super Korean right now. Hold on. Okay. You're supposed to eat it hot, yeah? Yeah, I mean, you could eat you could eat a dumpling with a spoon also. Yeah, but I then I wouldn't be I wouldn't be cultural, you know, multicultural here. Yeah, that's true. You like? That is really good. That is really, really good. Nice. Dumpling soup. What is what else? So you said what kind of meat is in that? Um, I think there's chicken and maybe even pork. I'm not sure. Chicken and pork with some carrots. Dude, this is sick. I like this. I'm gonna come here often. Yeah, why not, right? Why the fuck not? I don't know if I can eat all this though. I have a... Oh yeah, you have a thing where you eat two bites and then you say you're full? Well, I, I, I have eating issues. I have a thyroid problem where I don't gain weight. And so my stomach, uh, I, I'm just never hungry. It's like an issue in my brain. Like I just never feel hungry. I never, you know when you're hungry, you suppose, uh, something in your brain you know, cells are like shit is fired in your brain, so it tells your body you're hungry. I don't get that. You never get it. Only when I smoke, but I don't smoke anymore because it gives me anxiety attacks. Hmm. How do you, do you know, like, have you ever had like anxiety when you smoke weed? Yes. And how do you fix that? I fix that by smoking only sativa. Well, I smoke hybrids not too, but when you smoke sativa, instead of hitting a joint hard, you just take like a little baby bowl hit and you kind of microdose yourself. So you don't overdo it. And then you can manage a high when you're just like a tiny bit high. It's not like overwhelming where you start having panic attacks. It's just like, just like a tiny head change. And then after you feel comfortable with it, then you take a little more and you just microdose yourself. I also get super horny as fuck when I'm high. Mm. And uh, it's hard to, con it's, it's just hard to control myself. By the way, I forgot you don't really eat and I ordered a lot of stuff. There's more? Yeah. What the hell? There's more? More. You got four orders. Yeah. Two here and two more. This is like a buffet, dude. Bro. I'm already full. Yeah. Today. You gotta eat some more. What is that? That's uh, beef bulgogi. Yes, right. This is the, what is that called? Bing bing bop. Bing bing bop? Bing bing bop. Bing bing bop. That sounds like uh, the Crazy Frog song. Sounds like Hanson. Mm bop. Let me see. Let's try this out. It's got egg in it. Okay, that's sick. Let's try this out. This, is, this, is, this looks like some kind of salad or something for meat. Uh, bing bing bop is very very healthy. I can tell. There's a lot of... Spinach, carrots, egg, broccoli, beans. There's a lot of good stuff in that. But yeah, dude, um, sativas are cool. I used to overanalyze everything though. Like go to school and just, I, I would be so into what my teacher was saying when she's trying to teach class. I wouldn't even do the work. I would just sit there and think about what my teacher said. And then by the time I'm ready to do the work, the bell fucking rings. If you don't want anxiety, don't hit from a bomb. Just take little, get a little glass bowl, take super baby hits, and then you, you baby it into yourself instead of being like overly high, and then you won't get paranoid. What about edibles? What do you think about those? I hate edibles. They're way too strong. I can't fuck with edibles. What happens if you eat one? I start hallucinating and start going into like, I was walking up to a furniture store. What is that? Water? I don't know, it's vinegar maybe. Um, I start going up to a store and, and staring at the kitchen and imagining a family getting ready for work. I'm weird. Well, I mean, that's, that's, not, that's not too bad. I mean, I already told you the story what happened to me with the 500 milligram brownie, right? Yeah. With, with the no erection for three days. Yeah, you're crazy for eating that much. I, well, I ate half, like my friend told me to, which is still way too much. I didn't feel anything an hour later, I ate the other half, and then literally 30 minutes later I was destroyed. 
and I will never eat an edible again. Yeah, edibles are gnarly. Had to skip school. My mom was like, what's wrong with you? I had to stay in the bathroom for like nearly three days because I didn't want my mom to see me because I was like, you know, obviously fucked up. And uh, she was, t my mom was talking to me through the bathroom for three days. <coughs> yeah, a little heartburn from that alcohol. So you like the soup? Mm-hmm. It's good. Try this. This is like just tasty like beef. All right. I just wish I wasn't. I lost my other chopstick. I dropped it on the floor. Yeah, right oh, here. there's more. That's right. I think they're metal. They're not. They're not wood. All right, dude. Here we go. I just wish I was hungry, but uh, there we go. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Maybe you just force yourself to eat a little bit to get an appetite. You like that one? It is. It's good. I just had to get it down. So it's, it's hard to get it down sometimes, dude. Oh. Because I have the I have the the phobia of choking. Oh yeah. Along with the uh, eating issue thing, so I'm, I'm just I'm just messed up. I'm a, I'm fucked up, dude. Try it. I still love you, baby. So tell me about uh, tell me some stories with some. Uh, some famous people that you've hung out with. Some crazy, <laughs> so tell me a crazy story. Um, Give me some behind the scenes action. Hmm. Good God, you're a pussy? All right, listen, dude, in the chat, I have fucking issues, okay? How about you donate to the good cause and hit that fucking sub button, okay? And then maybe a child in Hollywood could eat. All right, what is it? It's not like a really long story, but I think I told it last night where I smoked weed with Quentin Tarantino out of a Pepsi can because we didn't have any rolling paper. Where'd you smoke it? Why didn't, why didn't you guys go get some? We used what we had. We're at Jimmy Kimmel Green Room. We had weed, but no rolling paper, so we just made the old school, high school Pepsi can bong. Huh. Um, Hold on, I need to. T I need. Mm, I need to turn off my alerts, dude. Hold on, before somebody uh, makes a stupid Twitch name and subs to me with this. So give me a second. I gotta restart the stream to turn off the uh, alerts here. All right. Vod number four. Uh, vod, vod number four, everybody. I thought. God, God damn it. All right, what's up, everybody? All right, my bad. I Oops, I had to turn off the, uh, I had to turn off the the notifications. I always forget to do that, <laughs> uh, but because like I just, I it, like I don't know, turns itself back on automatically or something when you exit the app. So I had to turn that off because obviously people will take advantage of that as much as I would love to have them on screen. So when you sub, you know, like Mr. Comfy, be a nice guy, you actually get some recognition. But sorry, I can't do that because people are stupid, and I really don't want that to happen. But hey, whatever, it, it is what it is. All right, so what's up? This food is bringing me back to life. Woo. I wish I could say the same. I mm. wish you liked eating more. I know, dude. It's, it's it, I've got issues, man. Like I said, I, I maybe I should try to smoke. Everybody in chat, do you think I should try smoking weed again? Because uh, if there's a way to get over the anxiety, I would love to to help my eating uh, things that I have going on. Like I was, just, I was just messed up, dude. I was. All right, so when I was born, I was not born a normal child. I was not born a, uh, born a normal child, basically. When I was born, um, I was really, like, like very overweight, severely overweight, like, as a baby, um, which, is, which is weird now, right? But I was severely overweight. I was born, when you were born, do you know how much you weighed? Um, I think, like, maybe, like, nine pounds. I was kind of a little bit bigger. I weighed about 17 pounds. No. Yeah. You're <laughs> For real, my mom pushed me out. I don't know how the hell she pushed me out, dude. My dad probably... 17? My dad probably regrets having me now. because <laughs> It's not been the same since, right? <laughs> but, 
but dude, I was about 17 pounds. So like, I don't know if that's like an over, like an underlying issue or not, but it probably, it probably is. And uh, yeah, it's, it's not fake. I could show you medical records, but I'm not going to because it's none of your business. I have me in the womb. Picture of me in the womb. I took up the whole fucking womb, dude. Like it was like expanded by the time I got out. That's sexy. It's not sexy. It's it's a medical disorder. I gonna love the scenery here. I mean, yeah, I kind of feel like I'm in a cafeteria at school or something. It's cool. I like it. It's like uh, it's really like I'm, I'm immersed. They got the news on. I'm immersed. I feel like I'm not. I feel like I'm in Korea. It's like the worst ambiance in any restaurant, but you know what? No, it's not bad. They got a little ball light. You come here for the food. Picture. They got the picture of the Korean stuff. I mean, it's it's good. It's better than like McDonald's or something. Fuck McDonald's. Eat your soup, kid. You can do it. Oh, dude, I'm so full right now. I had like one bite. <laughs> you had your one bite. You know what? I, what did I eat this morning for breakfast? I had a. Uh, I had a fuck. I had half a ham sandwich. Mm-hmm. And a monster. Honestly, I think it's the monster. Like, I think it's the caffeine that's killing my appetite. I hope I don't get like AIDS from wearing this hat. <laughs> hope it like like lice or something. Like, I don't I don't know, dude. I, I hope he didn't like do something like drop into the sewer or something. <laughs> I think it's the monster and the caffeine. Like, I just I just can't eat this, dude. I don't know. It, it like it, it it's actually painful. Like my throat starts to hurt. My mouth. I feel like. Uh, Don't drink Monster, dude. That shit's garbage. I mean, I do the sugar free. It's worse. I know the chemicals are worse, but it doesn't make me crash. Uh, my diabetes. I have like uh, a form of diabetes, so. Oh, well, not really. It's hypoglycemia. Mm. It makes me like feel like shit when I eat sugar, so. Mm. I go with the sugar free. So fuck it. I used to take uh, some caffeine pills. But those just made me, I, I just didn't eat shit all day, so I stopped. So what what? do you have caffeine for? Uh, because I like how it makes me, you know, ex it, ma it, ma it, ma it makes me like up and excited. It makes me like, you know what I mean? It makes me, it makes me have energy. Since I don't really eat, I need to get energy somehow, so. Hmm. <clears throat> you know, they have a... Uh... They have energy bars that have caffeine in it, so you could eat and get caffeine at the same time. Really? Mm-hmm. Huh. I need to get one of those. Also, chocolate has caffeine in it. Chocolate? Yeah. Like a Hershey bar? No, Hershey's is like fake chocolate. What you mean? We'd get like a 72% dark chocolate bar. Oh, dark chocolate? Yeah. Dude, dark chocolate's nasty. It's like cocoa and... It's like putting a whole thing of Hershey's, like, uh, cocoa powder into, like, a milk. Hmm. It's a required taste. What if, I put, what if I just get a marker and color a Reese's Puff? I mean, that probably works. <laughs> mm. mm -mm -mm. Oh, man. Yeah, actually, I'm going to do this. Here, can you? I'm just going to put the camera. Okay. I'm going to try and force this down my throat. Alright. I'm gonna force this down my throat. I mean, you don't have to go extreme. You can just enjoy it. It's hard. This is a nice big bite. It tastes good, too. You don't have to chew it a lot because it's mushy. Got a little garlicky, a little chicken, a little broth. Good for you. I'm just joking, but. <clears throat> um, okay. That's good. If you just put it in your mouth. Mm hmm. That's how you do food. If you just put it in your mouth, it's a lot easier than thinking about it. Yeah. Bro. It was hot though. It is still a little bit hot. 
Got a little manners, my manners right there. Good flavors, not too spicy. That's good chef. So what are you doing later? I mean, besides the costume thing, I'm gonna need this energy to get me out of my hangover zone. Uh huh. Um, after we attempt the costume thing, I'm down to just chill. If you wanna, if you wanna stream and just uh, hang out for a bit, mm -hmm. low key style. I'm down for that. We could play some PlayStation. We could suck each other's dicks. I mean, we could play some uh, other video games. Okay, Chuck, please. Sorry. Um, yeah, yeah, I'm down. I'm down to do whatever, dude. Um, I'm totally down to do some low key shit, high key shit, middle key shit. She's actually bringing the check. Oh, we were just joking. No, we'll, oh, we'll oh, get it. Yeah, we'll get it now. Yeah, we'll take it. We'll take it. Yeah, yeah. Thank you so much. Do you know how to speak Korean? Is the no. bill in Korean? The bill is in Korean, dude. What the hell? How do you how do you pronounce that right there, everybody? How do you pronounce that right there? What does that say? Like it's just symbols. How do you pronounce symbols? Beef balugagi. Bulgogi. Bulgogi, and then some symbols and junk. It, sounds, it looks like my tattoo on is like graffiti. Hold on, yo, can you compare? Yo, can you compare some shit? Hold on. Here, point this at my tattoo. Bulgogi, you know what bulgogi actually means? You're gonna think this is really ironic. What bulgogi is it? actually means respect in Korean. No. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> right, get my... How does that? Is that similar? Yeah, exactly. Exactly similar. <laughs> the dude who did my tattoo was not only ghetto, but he knew Korean. <laughs> All right, credit card roulette again? I'm down. All right, let's do this. Oh, you're still eating, aren't you? Do we got all this food? <laughs> we got all this food and we haven't even touched this shit. Not this or that, we haven't even touched it. I'm gonna, take, I'm gonna take this to some, some box. I'm gonna bring some of this shit with me. Yeah. You know when you're filming stuff, you don't wanna just like point the camera at one, one thing, one menu item. And I forgot that you don't really eat a lot. But this soup is so filling that I can't really tackle this or that. Right. I really wanted the bean bean bop even though I knew it was too much because it's so healthy. There's so many like healthy veggies in there. I thought it would make my hangover go away. All right, everybody. You so so everybody. You don't want to play credit card roulette. You want me to just pay? No, no. Oh, they're telling you to. Yeah, they want me to pay. I'm down to pay, but I thought credit card roulette would be a little bit more fun and give me the option of maybe not paying. <laughs> I don't waste food. I'm gonna take this with me and then I'm gonna fucking give it to somebody or something. I don't know. Or I'm gonna eat it later. I'm gonna eat it later. I don't waste food. This is just like beef jerky. You can make an omelet out of that. Yeah, I mean, I could put that in the omelet, dude. That's what I typically do. I put like, uh, I put beef and I put like meat inside my omelets and shit or stuff and uh, and then I eat and I'll shove it down my throat before I feel full. By the way, I those jack you left at my house, so nasty. Which ones? You left a pack of Jack Links at my Did house. you actually eat the beef jerky? Yeah, why? Bro, that junk was like a month old. Yeah, right. Those those are like a month old, dude. I had That's them I had them in my drawer for like a month and I brought them with me. Those Cause I ate one. Those disgusting chemical salt bombs probably would last through a nuclear war. <laughs> I mean, I, I, what do you mean? It's just meat with with salt and sugar. That's what I'm saying, like, a month old is nothing for that. Oh, all right. Well, I feel good. You digging the soup? I thought I poisoned you. It's comforting, right? This soup is comforting. Yeah, I mean, it's good, it's good. I mean, yeah. Oh man, feel good. I'm just gonna eat. Andy, 
talk to the chat. I'm, gonna right. I'm just gonna eat as much as I can real quick. Yeah, yeah. Don't make yourself sick though. You wanna be on camera or not? Uh, yeah, dude. Just, uh, just talk to the chat. I'll try to eat this, uh, so just talk to them. Okay. Hey, chat. How you guys doing? Ice hates food. Yeah, he's working on it. This dumpling soup is great, by the way. Try hard. Don't say that. That's what someone said to me. Don't, don't enable them. Why? What is that? It just, it's like, it's, it's like slang. Try hard is bad. Yeah. Well, but now that makes me sound bad. I mean, it's not bad, but it just enables them to spam it more. Oh. And then, uh. You mean like Kappa then, one two three? Yeah, but but we try hard, then it makes me look bad. Why? Because, because then people, well, well, I don't know. It just makes me look like uh, a lot of people complain. A lot of other streamers they complain that I condone the try hard, which I I I mean I don't I don't I don't know. I just don't I I don't really care about it. But streamers just make they they talk bad about me. They, they say, do. They say I'm a bad streamer because I allow my chat to do whatever they want. Really? Yeah. What does that have to do with try hard though? Basically, um, I mean, I don't know. I mean, how do I say it? I, you know, I'm just not even going to say it like that. I like try hard. I just don't like when people spam it. Because mm. it, it uh, <laughs> you know, I don't even know how to say this without making me look really bad, so I'm just going to ignore it. All right. Kappa, kappa, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Forcing is love. Forcing is life. Kappa, 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 Dum 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 I can't do anymore. You good man, you put effort in. I had about five bites there and uh I feel I feel I feel a lot better man. Yeah? I feel a lot better. It warms your soul. It makes me feel like I'm a human being again. Mm-hmm. When you don't eat, you just do you know like when you drink a lot of caffeine, it makes you feel like uh you're losing a part of yourself. You're losing your stomach. Mm. I got it back. I don't have that problem, <laughs> fat boy. <laughs> um, bro, you need to find the healthiest thing you could possibly eat that's also easy to eat and stick to that. What do y'all think? That's like, a good idea. Well, I, I did pasta. I, I did a lot. I did a lot of pasta, so. Pasta is easy to eat, and it's got like a lot of carbs and stuff. What's a good food to eat that you can? You could just hang up on them. I, I don't know who it is. They keep calling. They they are keep calling about for thirty minutes right now. I'm sorry. We're gonna get the check and leave. We didn't know they. Yeah, I don't know. We we. Yeah, we're about to leave. When we walked in the camera, we. Yeah, I I understand. We walked in, but we put the camera down so we don't show the name. I don't know how they found out. Sorry. Some, no. F some FBI stuff. What? Yeah. Better things to do. That's what exactly. Amen to that. Yo. Yeah. We're, we're about to leave, so. What's a good food to eat that's like easy to eat but has like a lot of macronutrients? What, what everybody in chat? What, 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 Chicken breast. Chicken's kind of hard to eat, man. It's dry. It's, it's tasteless, you know? Dude, you need a crock pot. You get a crock pot, you don't have to worry about <clears throat> setting your house on fire. You put a bunch of ingredients in, and you cook it, leave it there for seven hours until it becomes like a stew where it like cuts with a fork. 
You could do that with like beef. You can make beef stew. Seven hours, dude? I don't even... That's the thing, dude. You, no, fuck that. You you don't have to watch it. You can leave the house and come back and it won't burn. I don't know. I think somehow, some way, I might burn the house down. I left, mm. the, I left the candle lit by accident and I came back and it was knocked over some fuck, somehow. I don't know how, but somehow my counter was burnt. I had to like wipe that until the burn was gone. Was gone. And why the fuck are they asking for me instead of you? This is your stream. Like, what the hell? You're the guest. That's just kind of weird, the, though. The, the guest gets the more attention. Because I'm, I'm always here. You're not. They probably think you'll hang up on them and I won't or something. Uh, yeah. I, I mean, I don't even acknowledge it, so. <laughs> well... Thanks, guys. Now I can never come back to one of my favorite places in Koreatown. Thank you for that. Oh, sure you can. Sure you can. I mean, I they're not going to hate you for that. I mean, actually, kind of. they might. But <laughs> they absolutely might, dude, depending on what's being said. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. I'm almost ready. I'm taking two more bites of the beef, and then we're gone. Are you really taking this to go or no? Uh... No, <laughs> I, I don't want to carry this all, all day, to be honest. I don't blame you. I'll just get some more food later. Totally fine. All right. So next stop is the costume shop. Yeah, let's make this interesting. Y'all right. decide what costumes. What do I wear? What does Andy wear? Who wears what? And then we'll try to look for it. And because they probably have it because these are pretty big costume stores in Hollywood. So y'all decide. How about they decide yours and I decide mine? No, they, if they can decide mine, they have to decide yours because they're going to make me look stupid, so you have to look equally stupid with me. Bro, I don't give a fuck how stupid I look. I'll look as stupid as possible. So let the chat decide. Want, I just don't want to put anything that's like uncomfortable where I have to like... I want to be able to just put it easily over my jeans. Well, yeah, I mean, to... there's rules. They're not going to, like, you're not going to be wearing panties and, you yeah, know, like yeah. a bikini or nothing. But uh, there's rules. G guys, give him something realistic. Luigi and Mario? <laughs> That's really funny. <laughs> I, don't know. I think we could go more crazy. I think we can go way more intense That's than that. That's pretty good, though. It is good. I feel like that's too normal, though. <laughs> no, because of both of us. Luigi yeah, like... Mar you're Mario, right? No, I'm just kidding. Well, I'm the tall one, so I'm Luigi, yeah, and then nah. Mario's the, the plumber. Or maybe I'm Princess Peach, and you're Luigi. <laughs> <laughs> Do I get to fuck you later? Mm-hmm. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, no, you're like, boy, so now I know. Only like... when I'm drunk and horny. It's very rare that I'm both of those things at the same time. <laughs> Waluigi, yeah. No, dude, come on. Waluigi is, was in, like, one Mario game. Luigi is more known. Credit card roulette. Credit card roulette. Chad wants me to pay, but if you want to do credit card roulette, let's do it. Listen, we can do credit card roulette. I'm not going to fight you if you want to pay, but... I'm paying. I'm paying. You sure? I'm paying. Fuck credit card roulette. I'm paying. Alright. How about this? Let's just do credit card roulette to see who would have won, and you'll pay either way. Alright. Let's do it. And then I'll pay for the Uber. Okay. Well, if you're paying for the Uber, I gotta pay for the food. Yeah, you're gonna pay for the food. Okay. I just wanna see who would have won. Tip? Why would I do that? No, I'm just joking. <laughs> what kind of asshole would I be? Alright, right hold side. On, hold on. Alright. That's the left side, by the way. You got it wrong last time, too. This is why I was 2.3 GPA in school. <laughs> this one? Yes. Well, you would have paid either way. Oh, that was good. You just leaked my credit card. Oh, I did. Almost, kind of. That's fine. It's not like I have any money on there. I have two bank accounts. I have one with money and one that's like a, a fake bank account that's like in case I leak it or something. It's like got like, you didn't warn it's got like $200 me. on it. Huh? You didn't warn me. About what? I, I didn't even think about it when I handed you the card. Actually, that's a good idea. If you ever go on a date with a girl, I'm going to do that next time. I'm going to go on a date with a girl. I'm going to give her a card that has purposely no money on it. When my card gets declined, I'll be like, shit, can you do this for one for me? And then she has to pay. <laughs> I think that's a good idea. That's scandalous. Uh, yeah, I mean, I don't know. she's still going to have sex with me later. That's all that matters, to be honest. 
I don't know if she will. I might be a deal breaker. Oh, I mean, as long as I say I got it next time, I don't think she'd be too mad. And if she is, I really don't care. She's she's horny, I'm horny, we're probably it both drunk by if then. It's, if it's a first date or not. Like I said, we're probably both drunk by then, so when you're drunk, you don't care about shit. <laughs> sure, I was happy give food to the home. We can yeah, let's box this up. Let's go get let's we can give this stuff to like a homeless guy or something. Alright. Let's do put that. this rice on top of here. <laughs> they don't, yeah, they don't discriminate rice or not. There you go. Push that down. We're probably gonna have to get a box anyway, so let's go in a different container. Bum, bum, bum. Acting like I'm acting like a, I'm gonna ever go on a date with a girl again. Listen, listen, random pleb in Twitch chat. Oh shit. I may not go on a date with a girl ever again because I'm ugly and disgusting. But you're still watching me. Oh shit. So I come up on top. Oh on shit. On top of you. Because you're the bottom hoe. Body bitch. I don't even ever say hoe, but I said it this time because he kind of triggered me. Mm hmm. Wasted good food. It's not a waste, we're giving it away. <clears throat> <clears throat> do they do they know with the boxes? We didn't talk to them. Oh, well, they'll they'll look eventually. Why don't you go talk to them? Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna go ask for a box or something. Can we get some boxes, please? Some boxes, boxes please. Boxes? Yeah. What is that? Yeah, I oh, oh, the hot tea. Yeah. I almost forgot about it. I oh, thank you, man. Oh, mm -hmm. fantastic! Got I got the tea. I got I got I got the tea, man, that we ordered. Mm. Thank you. Oh, there's a call button here. Yes. What? I had no idea. I thought that was like a poker chip. Next time. <laughs> <laughs> this, this is in a casino or something. Yeah, the okay. casino, man. I'll give you one more of these, too. All right, cool. Well, it came with a little doggy bag. Yeah. Uh, is that? Uh, it's a pickup dog. Why? I'm just kidding. What is that? What? All right, a small little bag. Oh, uh, thanks. Not, not, not this. This one's this. This one better. All right, this one's better. He's going for this. Okay. Let me put this in the container here. <laughs> watch. Wait, film me first. Hold this on. is. Hold on. All right. All right. This is how a fat boy takes his food to go. Ready? One for you. One for me. One for you. One for me. Oh. Oh. You have no idea what I'm doing. Just keep doing it. <laughs> and th this is how a skinny this is how a skinny person takes theirs. <laughs> All right, we don't need this. Let's go. Oh, I'm joking. I'm gonna take this. So this homeless person will get it. One go, everybody. Just one spoonful is all it takes.
There we go. We got it. We got it. Hot tea. All right. Uh, they got my card. No, they didn't take my card. Did we already pay? I don't think so. I mean, where's this check right here? As opposed to what? As opposed to nothing. Divided by three? No, nope, it's just 42. Just by itself. Right. 42 what? On a quantum scale. The meaning of life is 42. What about the Big Bang? The meaning of life is 42. So there's no Big Bang. The meaning of life is 42. What about 43? That's not the meaning of life. That's one more than the meaning of life. Well, if it's one more than the meaning of life, then what could it possibly mean? I don't know the answer to that one. That would mean the meaning of life Thank is Thank you. not an infinite thing, and it continues going forward as one number higher. Have Therefore, you ever seen a spoon and a pen? It totally just leaked my... Dude, did I just totally... Uh, I fucked up, dude. I fucked up, man. I think I just totally leaked my credit card. Yeah, oh my god. Th that's what the spoon's for. That's what the spoon's for. It's for, uh... <laughs> gagging myself now because I leaked my shit. Oh my god. Okay. Just get, let's just get out of here. Tip for 55 is... What's... What's 3% of 55? <laughs> <laughs> joke, I'm joking, dude. Let me see. 55, I'll give her... 11 bucks. I'll, I'll, give, her, I'll give her like 15. All right. I'm a, I'm a nice guy. That's a nice tip. Just because we're assholes. People in chat want me to tip 100, but they don't understand that money is a real thing. And oh, yeah. uh, it's, it's not unlimited, so... 15 plus 55 is 70. I think. I hope. I mean, I don't know. Maybe I just overstepped. I don't know. Right there. All right. Cool. That's fine. I don't got any money on that card. And one, you don't have the back of the card for one. You don't have the expi expiration date for two. You might have the expiration date, but I don't have any money on the card anyways. It's the card I use to pay for my everyday stuff, so I only put like $200, $300 on it as opposed to all of it. So uh, it's it's totally fine. I don't care. Can cancel my card, dude. I can't, dude. I'm using the phone to stream. I'll do it later. It's 300 bucks. Nobody's going to be able to use my card anyways without the expiration. Oh, sorry. Without the thing on the back, so... I had no idea. All right, we're good. I'm just calling Uber. Uber everywhere pre-rolls in my VIP. Yo, can I use your phone to cancel this real quick? Nope. So you're gonna let them steal my money? Yeah, I'll let you after I call Uber. You're gonna have to give them all personal info and shit though. Oh, yeah, whatever, I'm not. I'm not doing that. You That's, should do it later because. It's, I mean, I don't got like. Then the stream's gonna listen to. I think there's like a hundred dollars on this card, anyways. Whatever. Nobody's. If, I'll just get it back. I'll call the bank. Said it wasn't me. They'll give me the money back plus compensation, and that's how you make money from the bank. You know, every okay. time we call the Uber, you're always getting the good ones. You're always getting the Uber SUV or the I Uber know. Black. I'm bad. I gotta stop wasting money. Well, I mean, I, I mean, I, I, there's not, it's not a waste if it's a nice ride. Yeah, it is kind of a waste though. I feel like you're taking me on a nice little date, you know, when we go in the <laughs> night, when we go in the nice Uber black All right, vehicle. I got a Lexus this time. No. I mean, shh. it's not, like, it's not like the. To me, the black cars are better. Boy, I know. That's why I, I'm very thankful when you do that. It's, it's really cool. I feel like I'm on a date with you. I feel like I, I have to suck your shit now. I gotta go. What? I gotta go. I gotta go back to Venice. Why? Because you're trying to suck my dick. And? I don't 
like that. It's making me uncomfortable. Don't pretend like you don't want to do it to me, too. We can take turns. I'm just, uh, I'm just sad. I'm just sad and confused. Do I don't you, know what to do. Do you want a hug? No, our car's here. Okay. Let's not talk in the Uber for a little while, all right? I need some time to get my head clear. But I have to uh, talk to you to get to, to understand what's going on. About it. I want to. I want to try and resolve this. All right, let's go. I want to help you. I'm mad. Resolve this together. I got you, man. You're gonna be okay. Sorry about that. Sorry. Have a nice day. Is he here? Um. My card's in my pocket, dude. It's in, it's in my wallet, in my back pocket. Don't worry. He's pulling up right now. Alrighty.